Detective, yes. I got your text that I thought we were meeting at the penthouse in two hours. Yes, that's what I wanted to chat with you about. I sort of had to postpone my date with Lucifer until we solved this case. Didn't want work getting in the way of me roofing the devil. <laughs> oh, Chloe. You're just stalling, aren't you? Are you having second thoughts? Yes. Yes, everything that you've told me about Lucifer. You're finding it hard to believe. Yeah. Being around him again, I, I just don't see the same monster that you do. No, of course you don't. Have you met him? Have you ever had a conversation with him? No. No, I'm, I'm sure he's the most magnetic individual you ever met. Charming and eloquent. Funny. Kind, even. Yeah, he is. It's all an act. Now listen to me, Chloe. The devil has been manipulating human beings since the beginning of time. If you don't respond favorably to something, well, he'll make an adjustment until you do anything to make sure he gets what he wants, because the only person that he is interested in is himself. But it, it, he seems so real. Yes, yes, that's what he does. That's what he's been doing for thousands of years, perfecting. Why do you think they call him the Prince of Lies? No, no. Lucifer always tells the truth, always. He does not lie. What if this is the biggest lie of all? 